Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation solution from here. And what we have here, this follows what we have a raised to power m plus n, which is the same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. As this here, this becomes 5 raised to power x times 5 raised to power 1 minus. Also, here follows what we have a raised to power m minus n. The same thing as a raised to power m over a raised to power n. At this here we have 5 raised to power x over 5 raised to power 1, then equals to 42 on this side. That is, yeah, this same thing as 5 raised to power x times 5 raised to power 1, that's 5, minus here also we can write as 5 raised to power x times 1 over 5 raised to power 1, which is 1 over 5 equals to 42 on this side. Then here we have 5 raised to power x common. We factor it out. We have 5 raised to power x into brackets. Here remain 5 minus 1 over 5 here. Then equals to 42 on this side. Watch this video to the end. Give it a thumbs up. Put your comment. Share this video and also subscribe. Then here, we bring this together as one fraction. This is 5 over 1. That is, we have 5 raised to power x into brackets. S E M E that's 5. Then here, this becomes 25 minus 1. Close bracket equals to 42 on this side. That is, yeah, we have 5 raised to power x times 24 over 5 equals to 42 on this side. Then, yeah, we, to remove this 24 over 5, multiply both sides by 5 over 24. Also, multiply this side by 5 over 24. That is, this year cancelled each other. And we have 5 raised to power x equals to 20. 42 times 5 all over 24. Then this also can be written as 5 raised to power x equals to 6 times 7 times 5 over 6 times 4. As this here, 6 cancel each other. All we have here becomes 5 raised to power x equals to 7 times 5 over 4. Then, next step here, we take the log on both sides. As this we have log 5 raised to power x equals to log 7 times 5 over 4. Then, all we have on this side follows when we have log a times b over c. And this we can express as log a plus log b minus log c. That is here. Yeah, all we have becomes log 5 raised to power x equals to log. 7 plus log 5 minus log 4 on this side. Then, yeah, we apply the power of log when well, we have log m raised to power p. This same thing as p log m. That is, all we have becomes x log 5 equals to log. 7 plus log 5 minus log 4. Then also here we divide both sides by log 5. Divide this side by log 5. Also divide this side by log 5. Which implies here log 5 cancelled each other. We have x equals to log 7 plus log 5 minus log 4 all over log 5 
watch this video to the end give it a thumbs up put a comment share this video and also subscribe then yeah we separate this into three fractions and we have x equals to log 7 over log 5 plus log 5 over log 5 minus log 4 over log 5 which implies here log 5 cancel each other we have one left which we can write as x equals to 1 plus log 7 over log 5 minus log 4 over log 5 then next step here we can express 4 as 2 times 2 that's 2 squared then over here becomes x equals to 1 plus log 7 over log 5 minus log 2 square over log 5. Then here we apply the power law of log ring. 2 comes here, then what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 7 over log 5 minus 2 log 2 over log 5. Then here we apply change of base. When we have log a, over log b this same thing as log a to base b that is what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 which implies the value of x here we have 1 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 then let's check here if this satisfy this given problem that is we substitute the value of x here which is x equals to 1 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 then what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 1 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 plus 1 also minus 5 raised to power 1 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 minus 1 then is it equals to 42 on this side then here we have 1 plus 1 that's 2 you can write it as 5 raised to power 2 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 then minus also here we have 1 minus 1 cancel out this will mean 5 raised to power log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5 then is it equals to 42 on this side then here we apply the law of indices when we have a raised to power m plus n which is the same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n and also a raised to power m minus n same thing as a raised to power m over a raised to power n then what we have here becomes 5 raised to power 2 times 5 raised to power log 7 base 5 then over 5 raised to power log 2 that's 2 log 2 base 5 yeah then minus here we have 5 raised to power log 7 base 5 over 5 raised to power 2 log 2 base 5 is it equals to 42 on this side then here we have 5 square that's 25 then times here follows and we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b 
that is here is seven then over here when we reverse two up here what we have becomes five raised to power log two square means five and this also follow this and is equals to two square which is equals to four that is what we have here is now four then minus here yeah, we have seven then over also four here yeah. this is equals to 42 on this side that is we have 25 then seven that's 175 over four minus seven over four is it equals to 42 on this side then here yeah, we bring this together as one fraction the SCM here is four and this becomes 175 minus 7 plus 168 is equals to 42 here. And 168 over 4 gives us 42, which is equals to 42 on this side. Then we have left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to. 1 plus log 7 base 5 minus 2 log 2 base 5. Satisfy this given problem. And thank you for watching. Don't forget the steps. Subscribe for more videos. And turn the notification bell. Share this video, give it a thumbs up, and put your comments. See you next class and bye for now.